A discrete variable is a type of variable in mathematics and statistics that can only take specific, separate values. Unlike continuous variables, which can take any value within a range, discrete variables are countable and have distinct gaps between possible values. They are often used to represent quantities that can be counted rather than measured. For example, the number of students in a classroom can only be a whole number. There cannot be 25.5 students. Discrete variables are commonly seen in surveys, experiments and data analysis, where they help categorise and organise information into specific groups. Because they consist of distinct values, they are often visualised using bar graphs or frequency tables rather than line graphs. There are many real-world examples of discrete variables, particularly in situations where whole numbers are used. One example is the number of pets a person owns. Someone might have 0, 1 or 3 pets, but not 2.7 pets. Similarly, the number of books on a shelf is a discrete variable because books are counted in whole numbers. Another example is the number of goals scored in a soccer game where the possible values are limited to whole numbers like 0, 1, 2 or more. In schools, the number of students in a classroom, the number of questions on a test and the number of days in a month are all discrete variables because they consist of fixed countable values. A discrete variable differs from a continuous variable in that it has specific, separate values rather than an infinite range of possibilities. A continuous variable can take any value within a given range, meaning it can have decimals or fractions. For example, height is a continuous variable because a person's height can be 5.8 feet, 5.81 feet, or any other precise measurement. Temperature is another example of a continuous variable because it can be measured in extremely small units, such as 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. In contrast, a discrete variable, like the number of cars in a parking lot, must be a whole number. There cannot be 4.3 cars. This distinction is important in data analysis because discrete and continuous variables require different types of statistical methods and visual representations. Discrete variables play a key role in organising and analysing data that involves countable quantities. They help categorise information in ways that are easy to interpret and visualise, making them useful in fields such as business, education and science. Unlike continuous variables, which can take any value within a range, discrete variables consist of distinct, separate numbers. Recognising the difference between these types of variables is essential for accurate data collection and analysis, ensuring that information is represented correctly and used effectively in decision-making.